is Kelly Hobart from Alpaca Direct and I'm here talking about this nice Pico edge. And this Pico bind off makes a beautiful edge and you can use it on socks as well as shawls. And this is the Golden Hour Shawl by Andrea Maury and I'm gonna show you how she has us do the Pico edge for this bind off. So it's super easy to do. All we do is we start by using the cable cast on and we cast on two stitches. So I insert my working needle between the first and second stitch and grab my working yarn and bring it through and then take the left hand leg of our new stitch and put it on the left hand needle. And then I do that again, grab that loop and put the left hand leg on the needle. Now I'm, I've cast on two stitches and I'm gonna bind off Four. So we bound off one, bound off two, bound off three, and four. Then we take our stitch and put it back on the left hand needle and we cable cast on two stitches. And so I have one and two, and then we bind off four. We just keep repeating this pattern over and over. So we bound off one, bound off two, and three, and four. You can see this method takes a lot of yarn, so make sure you're giving yourself plenty of yarn to be able to do this bind off because it does take a tremendous amount of yarn. So I cast on one and then cast on two and then I'm gonna bind off four. So I have bound off one and two and three and four. And then take that stitch and stick it back on the left hand needle and cable cast on two. Always making sure to put that left hand leg up on your needle. And then we'll bind off four again. So we're binding off one, two, three, and four. Then we stick that last stitch that back on the left hand needle and we cable cast on two. So we keep cast on one and two, and then we bind off four. So we bind off one and two and three and four. And then we stick that stitch back on the left hand needle and we cast on two using that cable cast on method that we've been using. And then we bind off the last four stitches. One, actually this one is two, it's three stitches that we have at the end, but that works out just perfectly fine. And we would pull our working yarn through and then we have our Pico bind off is complete.